to uh, the Middle East analyst, uh, Israel Shamir, who's in Moscow now. Uh, welcome to the program. Uh, Vice President Pence is visiting Israel for the first time since Donald Trump's move to declare Jerusalem the capital of Israel. Um, how do you think he'll be welcomed? What will the response be? Well, well let's say that the, uh, Pence's visit to the area had been postponed many times. Uh, after all, it materialized. But the agenda also changed meanwhile. The, in the original version, uh, Pence was supposed to come to meet the Christians of the Middle East, the Copts uh, in Egypt, the uh, Orthodox in Palestine. So that was basically his idea. But it turned out that after the recent moves by uh, Trump Pence administration, no Christian person in the Middle East would like to meet with American Vice President. He actually met with total refusal of every uh, spiritual uh, leader of the area to meet with him. And that was uh, the Christians and the Muslims, both of them, all of them, refused to meet. In Palestine, uh, in Israel, uh, again, Christians, Muslims refused to meet with him. In the uh, PNA, everybody refused to, uh, to meet with him. Mahmoud Abbas refused, and other important persons also refused. So actually, the only people he could meet with, that is Israelis. And Israelis are doing for him full red carpet treatment. He is going now... <coughs> Sorry, he is going now to the Knesset, to the Israeli parliament. <laughs> Sorry, it's Let very cold Let me ask you another Moscow. question while you, uh, while you recover. Let me ask you um, about this trip, because it included visits to Egypt and Jordan, both of these countries opposed to the Jerusalem Declaration. What was Pence's reception like there, and what is the relationship like now with those other traditional allies? Well, uh, 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 the same thing is over there. Nowhere Pence was welcomed, not, nor in Egypt, neither in Jordan. He was received by the official heads of state, but uh, in Egypt uh, there was a great dissatisfaction about the visit. In Jordan there was also a lot of tension. The bigger part of the population of Jordan uh, are of Palestinian origin, and they are also very unhappy about his visit. So I would say, uh, at all, in general, we would say that uh, President Trump and uh, Vice President Pence succeeded to make the United States as unpopular as probably anybody can do. Israel Shamir in Moscow, thank you for joining us.